My name is Tara. I have a two-year-old daughter named Layla. She's the most perfect little angel in the world. Sometimes. She's the best thing that's ever happened to me. I definitely think, like, when I used to wake up for myself, I didn't really know what I was doing with my life. And now, like, with Layla, I have to make sure, you know, she's fed, she has a bath, she's looking cute for that day or whatever. I have to make sure she's wearing shoes, because she, she would not wear shoes if it was not for me. Is Momo and Layla going to go to the ultrasound with us to see your sissies? Yeah. Tiara is my younger sister and the mother to my niece, Ella. I was 15 years old when I first got pregnant with Ella. Ella has a great personality. She is very outgoing. She's very sassy. She's smart. She's loving, caring. She's just a very sweet toddler. And now I'm pregnant again. could not be me. That's all I know, it could not be me. I would say this baby was not planned yet. I knew I wanted another one soon uh, because I wanted Ella to have a little sister or a little brother, you know, close in age like me and my sister. But it was not, we weren't trying. Let's just say we weren't trying yet for a baby. So. <laughs> Ella, Ella. Mom. She's gonna have to get in the car and take a nap because I can't deal with it. D and I live in Maryland now, and that is because he is in the military, and that is where he is stationed. Even though traveling back to Kentucky is very hard for me and Ella, I'm still glad that I'm able to come home and see my mom and see my sister and my family um, and get to spend some time with them before I have a new baby. You're can huge. I, can I sit beside you, Eddie Nay? Yeah. <laughs> Say hi, Tay Tay. Is mommy having a baby? I'm Taylor, this is my daughter, Adeline, and I'm 20 weeks pregnant. I'm Alan, and I'm two years old. <laughs> yes, girl. So funny. That was a good job. I'm proud of you. That was a good job. Are y'all ready shovel? to go get this ultrasound together? Yeah, yeah I'm ready. Me too. It's, it's like, OK, so it's crazy because when Taylor was first pregnant when she had before she had Adeline, she was due in July. And um, she was doing October. I was doing October. And now we just reversed now it's, it. It's like reverse. Like she's doing July and I'm doing October. Yeah, so it's like exactly three months apart again. Like, it is crazy, but I promise it was a coincidence. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> it's like it, it did this on purpose. I wonder what they have to say about the pregnancy <sighs> pack now. Now, a lot of people on social media questioned whether you three had a pregnancy pack. pack or whatever. Yeah. Did the three of you have a pregnancy pact? Definitely not. Yes. I didn't find out I was pregnant until after she already gave birth. I was 15, so, I mean, I definitely wasn't, like, going to sit down with my older cousin and, you know, plan a pregnancy. That's just silly. Yeah. I Honestly, think our family I mean, has a pregnancy curse, but I broke but, mine. I, mean, yeah, because I, a, I did I think it's a blessing because, 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 as you can like, see, I got two pregnant women beside me. Okay, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm not no. pregnant. Let me pause, okay? Because first, I was pregnant, and Tierra didn't find out until, like, a few months after I found out that she was pregnant. And Tara didn't even find out until after Tierra had her baby. So just wait until I have my baby, and then you can say you broke it. Broke it. OK, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, god. Yeah, yeah, let me not. <laughs> yeah, you better not. Or Brianna. No, I'm not. There's no way. Come on, you're going to go in Candace's car with Mommy. Mommy's coming, too. Oh, oh, like Candace is our aunt. Candace is my sister. And we were kind of like the girls were with our kids, like the girl I guess they pack. started the pregnancy pack, but yeah. now we started the pregnancy pack. There are five generations of teen mothers in my family. I have the distinct honor. This is my first five generations ever in 20 years. So I'm super excited. I always preach to Tyra and Tierra about like sex, having kids, having kids at a young age, uh, because it was so hard on me. I don't think anyone hopes for their kid to get pregnant at 17 years old, but I mean, I think that she's proud of the mother that I have become and like what I'm doing with my life. So I think maybe she would have been disappointed at the time, but I don't think she's disappointed now. Adeline, are you excited to see your baby sister? How is Noah different with this pregnancy than with Adeline? He worries. I mean, he, he definitely supports this one more and like he wants to like go to doctor's appointments, and, like 
more kind of involved. Yeah, he's more involved and talks about it. But of course, does that kind of upset together. you some since he wasn't there? Sometimes when we're talking about stuff, I'm like, well, I wish he would have been there with like that for Adeline, just because when she gets older, I don't want her to be like, I'm one of, your, I'm the only kid of yours that you didn't, you weren't around for. I'm Noah, dad of two-year-old Adeline and soon to be dad of another baby girl. At the beginning of our relationship, like when I first got pregnant and stuff, like Noah wasn't really around, and that's why my family didn't like him. I mean, it was it was rough at first, just you know, my teenage years was kind of wild, so um, it was a lot to get used to. I kind of had to grow up a little bit, and then, but now you know, I'm older now, and so I've been taking on responsibilities, and so we've been good. What do you think? She means her shut up. Good morning. Okay. How are you? But you gotta wait until yeah. we're done. <laughs> come you on. all will come this way? Yeah, come maybe on, we're, we're gonna get you on all. We're gonna go see the baby. I wanna put it up. Shh. Ella, we're gonna go see the baby. While I'm home in Kentucky, I plan on getting a 4D ultrasound. All right. Where is um your honey today? Um, all the 11 hours away, back oh, home, no. Maryland. With Dee joining the military, it's definitely difficult. I appreciate him, you know, willing to join the military and um, support our family, but being 11 hours away from any help and stuff is very difficult. It's also hard with um, us living in Maryland because I have no family around, and Dee also works 48 hour shifts, so a lot of the time it's just me and Ella there by ourselves. When I joined the military, I did not imagine that we would have another kid so soon. Uh, at the same time, I'm kind of happy that it did happen that way. We're kind of like keeping them closer to age and kind of getting it out of the way early. Oh my God. The baby girl. Look, look at her up there. Look. Oh, definitely a baby girl. Mm -hmm. You probably bought a lot of girl stuff. I love oh, it. yeah, she's got everything. I love it. She said. Oh, you see your sissy, Ella? Oh, baby. Have you got a name picked, picked out yet? Sissy? Inslee Joanne. Inslee Joanne, I like that. Um, yeah. I think it's super crazy that we're just having girls after girls. I think we're all just made of girls. It's crazy, but we're blessed that we all have girls. Because if there was one boy out of all three of them, it would just be like the oddball. So I feel like we're blessed we all have girls, but then again, I'm like, God, the sassiness out of all three of them. <laughs> all right, I just had this back right there. You guys didn't the lights on or anything? All right. Is this your this is your second baby or first yes, baby? Second baby. Okay. Look how tiny Taylor's baby looks. Oh, no. No, it's so I know she looks so tiny. Next to Inslee, don't she? Oh my God! I see Adeline. I love looking at Adeline and just like pointing out the features she has of mine and Noah's, and. Most of the time, I just think it's so crazy that we made a kid. <laughs> it's just so crazy to me. I'm really excited to have our baby and just see, like, look at both of our girls and see how different they are, too. I believe our future holds many blessings, many, many great things to come. I'm, I'm excited for our future. How do you do these things with twins? Um, I found twins the other day. The lady was 20 weeks and four days. And um, she didn't know. She thought she only she had didn't, one. She didn't know. She thought it was just one baby, and she came in, and it was uh, it was twins. Oh, and she already that's gonna be girls. girls. No, no, and it, and no, it girl. is not. Well, I think I would go crazy if I walked in here and you was like, Oh look, there's another one. So cute. <laughs> Thank you, you want to check it out? I, mean, it's hard I just want to see. see. You don't if, I, if I find a baby, I'm going home for grits today. Your belly ring. What does it look like without a baby in there? Empty. <laughs> That's what they I'm Just make sure. Okay. No, baby. It looks like Tyra is pregnant with a taco. No. <laughs> or emotion. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. All right. Is this going to be easy, girl? But mm -mm. Mm -mm. no amount of babies in this world can make me want to have another baby right now. I really am just trying to take some time to focus on me, and then I guess we'll see.